Trying to find new ways to stand out in order to be the top choice for consumers and potential employees is a challenge in today's business world. We sent Julie McDonnell to one of the world's largest producers of acrylic, Lucite International, part of Mitsubishi Chemical Corporation, to see how it inspires its workforce. For 75 years, this Lucite International site and its people have been producing some of the world's best-known acrylic products. It's a business that's part of the DNA of this northern British community. It is a massive employer in the local area and our aim has always been to continue that. So we want a sustainable future for the chemical industry and particularly our site here at Castle on Teesside. Melanie Jury is the site's director. She started her career here as a chemical engineer and now runs the plant providing opportunities across the generations and in a variety of engineering, scientific and commercial disciplines is vital to the future of the business. Actually, when we take people on, we want them to be our future leaders. We have people coming from school who start when they're 16 and do a production apprenticeship. You can have people coming from universities or you can have people with degree level apprenticeships so they start at 18. Um, and all those types of people of all those different routes have made it to the very top in our organisation. Here the focus is on producing acrylic, but it's also about developing and creating that team of diverse and powerful, talented people to drive the business straight into the future. Working on Lucite's largest site are colleagues Derek and Fred. Derek started in the chemical industry after a career in the armed forces. Fred arrived here straight from school. I came here from the military. There was a lot of um, transferable skills I could I, I could bring with me. But I think it's quite a boring place to work and it's all just follow on procedures. It changes massively, you see new things every day, meet new people. It's a good place to work. We had uh, vessel change outs on uh, the AMI cooler. Fresh from delivering a recent shutdown on site is Jamie Foster. He manages turnarounds, one of the most critical times in the operation of a plant, which can have a profound ability to affect its financial future. With everyone working around the clock brings a massive buzz and a sense of achievement for the teams here. There's a lot of pressure. Basically, you've, uh, you've got a, a long-term deadline, a critical path that uh, you've got to hit, which uh, obviously there's a lot of money involved, so you want to do that as, 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 as quick as possible. But, You've got deadlines every day where you're following a schedule, uh, various tasks, a multitude of tasks. You've got uh, scaffolding going up and down, lagging works coming on and off. There's no slow days and no, no days the same, really, which is what it's all about. It's good pressure. Off-site at Lucite's pilot plant, chemical engineer Hussein Amin showed me how Lucite designed new plants while optimising current sites using scaled-down pilot plants. It's amazing to think that we start at even lab scale on the bench top and then to this stage and then up to a full scale plan. It's incredible to see how that transition happens. And for me, that's why I love engineering, taking a small idea and turning it into a full scale plant that produces thousands of tons. It's a very good blend of problem solving, but then also creative thinking about problems. It's definitely a lot of responsibility at a very young age because you are working with chemicals that are extremely hazardous. Um, but for me, it's extremely rewarding to know that when I go home on an evening or on a Friday that I've made a difference. Solving customer challenges on the sales side is also something close to the heart of sales manager David Tyndale, who deals with speciality polymers and resins. Our business is focused on making uh, dental and medical products, so uh, we take things that customers come to us with, problems like the ageing population, and we create products that help them out. So it starts with things like orthodontic braces and works its way through false teeth and dentures and even things like bone cements for hip replacements and working with them to solve problems that they didn't really know were solvable until we came along. That's a really rewarding thing to do. Serving customers in more than 100 countries, the teams here and their innovations and commitment are the driving force behind a business that wants to make a positive contribution, not just locally, but across the globe.